Hello, my dear subjects. Mikey Bly here. I, I'm going to play Sort the Court. I'm a little bit behind on this game. I'm a little bit behind on most games. You may have noticed this, but I, um, I know, I know the, I know the concept. I'm just talking bullshit. Hey, wait a second. Let's just, let's just break this up a little bit. I have one. Mikey Bly here. I'm going to play Sort the Court. <laughs> um, I thought this would be a good little thing for me to pick up and have a pop at for while I'm away on holiday. So this is one that you'll be seeing while I am living it up back home. Probably is in the pub with a pint in one hand and a Jager bomb in the other. So yes. In the meantime though, here we go. So the basic premise is, wait a minute, I think my camera's in the way of this. Wait, wait, wait. Okay, I think that's better. Just so you can see the little stats at the bottom, like how many people, how many, how many happy, and how many money we have. <laughs> oh god, <laughs> this is terrible. <laughs> okay, so the premise is you have to make decisions based on what people ask you, and it's going to increase or decrease certain aspects on the bottom left. I guess the premise is you just try your best to not totally fuck everything up and die or kill everybody or both, basically. So anyway, what advisor it says, my lord, I'll help you rule your kingdom, but you have to make the tough choices. Just say yes or no. Understand? Yeah, I guess. Mm -hmm. Good, you've already got the hang of it. <laughs> you may think that now, but give me ten minutes. Then this kingdom will be in ruins. Our city is still very small right now, but it certainly has the potential to grow. It's like what someone would say who's trying to say some fucking pyramid scheme shit. Perhaps one day we will have a bustling metropolis and you'll be invited to join the Council of Crowns. There's your end. There you go. There's an objective. It's not just keep going and keep going and see how long you can go. There is an end game. For now, all you need to concern yourself with is keeping the citizens happy and growing our population. Well, yes, okay, I will get on that. Do your best, sir. To be honest, the king looks a bit fucking weary. He looks a bit out of it. He looks like he doesn't really care too much. He actually looks like me if I can grow my beard that long. I haven't got high hopes for this guy, too. Well, why are his trousers so short? <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> it's like a man child sitting on the crown. A gold. A go sitting, sitting on the throne. A gold throne surrounded by money. It doesn't look interested at all. It's like some spoiled brat was just given a crown and said, there you go. Good luck. This does not bode well. Oh, jeez, that's a good start. Any mysteries afoot? I could do some snooping for a small fee if you're interested. Well, what kind of start is that? I don't know if there's any mysteries of foot. We only have a hundred people living here. Bugger off. <laughs> Are you suggesting you know all the secrets of the universe already? Yes. Jog on. Oh, hello. We've captured some foes on the battlefield. Shall we bring them home and put them to work? I mean, it depends. It depends if they're still enemies or if they're willing to switch sides or not we could bring them to put them to work but then they might just say fuck that we're not going to work we're in the city walls we're going to wreck the place now ah, let's see what this is okay we'll get them into town then hopefully they don't rip any shit up oh well ahem <clears throat> might I get a cup of tea for you my liege well why would I say not a cup of tea Ah, yes. Nice and hot, sire. Don't ask me if I want a cup of tea. Just bring me a cup of tea, okay? If now we're butler, don't even ask. Just give, okay? Just, there, there, was never a, there was never a time I would say no to tea, okay? <laughs> yet, yet. Mom says I need to ask her permission to go on an adventure. So can I? Please? Please? I don't know, you look a little bit small. I mean, what if I send you on an adventure and you die and your mum comes and is really pissed off with me? No. Mm -mm. Oh man, you're so boring. Sorry, I wasn't risking your life. Come back when you're a little bit taller. 
people are happy, the city is growing. Awesome. Me do good? Did me do good? I wish to construct a tavern, but I'll need some gold from you to make it happen. How much gold? Uh, like a couple hundred. I haven't got a couple hundred. Come back when I've got some more money. Man, guess I'll cancel our plans. Oh, right, so we're not really... Damn it. What the f... I'm hungry. Can I eat some, folks? I've got plenty of gold so I can pay you back for the... lives. We do need gold, and we have some spare people. But is that going to affect the happiness and the population? I mean, gold is going to come in handy down the line, isn't it? Really, I mean, you need gold to pay for new stuff. Alrighty. Yeah. Cool, I'll just need a few. Here's your payment. I, I, I think five, I think five lives is good for a hundred coins. That, totally. Yep, that totally seems cool. Cool. Seems good to me. Now if that... Does it want something? I... I... I'm not trying to make a pun there. Um, no, what just happened? I feel happy. What, because I gave it a thumbs down? I'll take it, I guess. Sitting's uh, monkey has been running around flinging stuff at them. Should we put out a bounty on it? If we say yes, will it increase the happiness a bit more? I mean, we got a bit more gold now. Yeah, I don't know how much it's gonna cost though. 30? We'll have that monkey captured in no time. 30 gold to get one happiness? That seems a bit steep. Oh, hi, Georgie. Hey bud, care to flip a coin with me? Heads, I give you a bunch of gold. Tails, I take a bunch of your people's souls. I could do with some more gold. Yeah, okay. Ah, uh, you got me. It's heads. Enjoy your gold! <gasps> Yay! It's raining money! Ah, oh, that's a good... That's a good day's work right there. Yep. Ooh, awesome. Yes! Thanks to Georgie. The day would have been a little bit of a bust if it wasn't for Georgie. Okay, hi. Howdy. Gardener, really? I guess I should have guessed from the flowers and the fact that she's wearing what appears to be a kind of leaf dress. Plants are interesting, don't you think? I would like to open a garden. May I have some workers to help me? Why not? It's probably going to increase happiness to have a garden around, right? Gardens are nice and make people happy. Thank you, I will send them back as soon as they're done. Does that mean I get them those three back then? So do I even lose anything, really? Oh, what the? LD 3.4. <laughs> Hello, I am serial number L D three point four. K k k. Can't you f f fix me? Might be worth it. Yes. Ooh. Okay. The the thanks, friend. I am become fixed. Doesn't seem like you have. Come back when you got some legs. Maybe it'll be. Is that uh, Lil? Lil, he's so cute. He's a mini vampire. Oh, do you want some blood? Oh, sorry. Hello, friend. Care to gaze into my magical vampire crystal? No, thanks. Mm -hmm. You live the rest of your life never knowing. Maybe for the best. Sorry, buddy. Maybe in cute, but I ain't falling for your tricks. My lord. I wish to embark upon a treacherous quest. Go for it. How much is that going to cost me? For the kingdom. I shall return to you, Lord. On you go then. Didn't cost me anything. Oh, hi, bud. Little Timmy. Ah, little Timmy. Nice to meet you. You like ice cream? Who the... Who, who, the, who doesn't like ice cream? <laughs> Mwah. Me too. But did he just give me a kiss? Okay, bud. Go back home, it's late, isn't it? Hmm. Well, ooh, 12 people. Nice. 
Nice. We're not totally we're not totally wrecking everything. That's awesome. Oh hi. <gasps> it's a meow meow. Looks like you want somebody to pat his belly. Kitty bellies are traps. But I, I can't resist. Oh, cool. That wasn't easy. That wasn't easy happiness game. Oh. Hi, Monsieur Mouton. Hello, sir. Are you looking for experienced barbers in your court? I'm sorry, I don't know where my accent went there. <laughs> I don't know why I even try to do an accent. I'm so sure I can't Um, I don't see... I don't know, though. You're an experienced barber, but you, you, you can't cut your own hair. You could do a cut in mine. Go on, then. <laughs> then I shall join you. I am the best of the best. And also a fairly stereotypical Frenchman. Oh, I'm so sorry. I am so fucking sorry. Oh, he's back. You've got a skeleton of your own, you know. Don't you find it weird that you can't see it? Not really. It's kind of covered in other shit. No, because science... And you don't think anything is weird, do you? I find you pretty weird. Does that count? Hi. It's a chicken. It's a cluck cluck. Mock mock. It's running wild. Should we try to capture it? Yes. Mm -hmm. well, this thing is dangerous. Apparently, it killed somebody. It's, evidently, it has warped here from Hyrule. Evidently. That mischievous monkey has been captured. I shall send him in for your judgment. Let us lay judgment upon this monkey. I rule that we hang him. Oh my god, has he got earrings? Peanut. He's defending his case. Should we punish him for flinging stuff? He looks a little bit... He looks a little bit like he doesn't really give too much of a shit about flinging shit. Does he? He doesn't... Look at him. He doesn't care. He d Does he look remorseful to you? He doesn't look remorseful to me. Pass judgment. Off to the dun the dungeons is too lenient for this little bugger. In my opinion. Well, it's a bit of a slow day that one, but you know, eleven people. Yay. Okay. Oh hi. Your head is so shiny. It's like it's like this this it's like all of this just escaped down here. It's like it just moved. It went on vacation and never returned. My boat's too tiny to catch many fish. Can I have some gold to upgrade it? I'll pay you back, I swear. We have got a bit of spare cash, but how much is it going to cost? I hate it when they don't tell me the cost of things. What if it cost me 200? Ah, go on then, I'm too nice. 100, okay. Oh, you won't regret this. You'll see. Well, you better just quick turn around with profits, please. Hey, little Timmy's back. Mwah. Can I have a coin? A gold coin? Gold coin. Yeah, okay, little bud. Thank ya. Thank ya. You're welcome. It's too cute to be annoyed with. Working conditions for us are unsafe. Will you please spend some gold on improving our ability to work? Ah, it seems like a silly thing to not pay money towards. Ah, that's not too bad. Thanks, the builders appreciate this, Gov. Have a good day. One of our prisoners has escaped. May I have some gold to offer a reward for her recapture? Why does everybody need money off me today? No. Mm -mm. Forget it. They're probably all the way out of the city by now. We'll live with it. Hello. What the hell? What's on your hat? What is that? I've got a business proposition for you and your tiny little town. Are you interested? Yeah, okay. I think. Aha! I will bring you details soon. The workers we captured and recruited have sped up our billing processes, resulting in more tax income. Hell yeah! Ooh, we spent some gold, but... But... Happiness and population has gone up on the whole, so... It's good. It's good. 
Uh, my liege, there's a man in the foyer asking to join your guard. He's got an eye patch, looks a little shifty. What do you think? Should we take a chance on this stranger? Shifty guy with a shifty eye patch? Generally shifty looking guy? Screw it. Mm -hmm. Better have him with us than against us. Indeed, more swords will help us. Indeed, cup of tea? He just asked me, uh, what about my tea? Give me my damn tea! Oh, hi, Georgie. Heads are giving me a we can, we, can, we can afford to lose a, a, a few people, can't we? Mm -hmm. Ah! Oh, 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 it's tails. I'll be taking those souls. Better luck next time. I'm sure my, I'm sure my people are so overjoyed that their king gambles with their lives for a few points now and again. Points? Points? What the hell's a point? A caravan of mine wishes to camp in your city for the next few days. Might that be arranged? I don't see why not. Mm -hmm. Quite agreeable. We shall work together again, I hope. I certainly hope so too, if you remain as pleasant as this. Uh, oh, hi, Gran. That she's literally, she is actually called Grandma. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, Sally. Can I borrow a coin for the newspaper? Are my people so poor that they need to come to the king to ask for coins? Yeah, go on then. It'll give me a nice round number of coins. Three, four, five, I like that. Thank you, dearie. As long as it's not the sun. There's a petition going around to open our borders to the neighbouring town. What do you say? The more the fucking merrier. Mm -hmm. Way! That was totally worth it. Together, our towns will grow stronger. Yes. And I shall maybe rule more than one place. The Sutherland's caravan is resting in town. Our citizens have been trading with them, producing a small amount of tax income. Well, that's good, isn't it? Awesome. Day six is complete, and everything was a plus, even though I lost that bet with Georgie. Yeah. Okay. I want to call it at the end of day six here. But I'm going to pick this up, I'm going to do another part, I'm going to just see how far I can get and how great or terrible I can make things. So stay tuned for the next part of that and please, oh sorry, uh, have yourselves a good morning, afternoon, evening or night. <laughs> please like and subscribe and uh, check out my Facebook and Twitter below. And um, yeah, see you guys next time. Hope you're having a great holiday season unless you're working. If you're working, I am so sorry, I'm so sorry, I don't mean to upset you. I'm sure you'll have some days off eventually, right? Yeah. Bye.